Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I will show you some methods to fix PS Remote Play not working, can't connect to your PS4, PS5 on iPhone, iPad or Android device. So, firstly, try disable and re-enable Remote Play on the console. Just go to Settings. Scroll down then select Remote Play Connection Settings. Uncheck Enable Remote Play for about seconds. Then re-enable it. After that, if you still can't connect to console, then try turn on and off airplane mode on iPhone, iPad or Android device. Next, close PS Remote Play app and reopen it. In case the problem persists, try the following methods. Method 1. Restart your devices. First, please, restart the iPhone, iPad or Android device. After that, if you still can't connect to PS4, PS5, then restart PS4, PS5. To do this, press the power button present on the front panel of the console to turn it off. The indicator will blink a few times. After turning off your PS4, PS5, unplug the power cable from the power source, and disconnect any peripheral attached to your console, such as a controller, headset, hard drive, etc. Wait for about 5 minutes before connecting it again to power and restart the console. Try connect to your PS4, PS5 and see if the error, can't connect, is fixed. If the problem still occurs, then restart the router, modem. Just turn off the router, then unplug the modem and router from the power outlet. Wait at least 3 minutes. Plug the modem back into the power outlet first, wait 1 to 2 minutes, then it's time to power on the router. Wait for all panel lights on your cable modem to become green on before try connection to your PS4, PS5 again. Method 2. Stay up to date. Make sure that you have the latest version of PS4, iPhone, iPad or Android system software. The updates always offer bug fixes and system performance optimizations. So, just ensure that the latest version is installed on your devices. Beside, update the PS Remote Play app to the latest version. Just go to Google Store for Android users and Apple Store for iPhone, iPad users. Then, check if the PS Remote Play app has any available updates. If available, update it. Method 3. Reset Network Settings. To do this on Android device, go to Settings. Scroll down then tap on General Management. Tap on Reset. Tap on Reset Network Settings. Tap on Reset Settings. It will ask for your phone's passcode. Enter it and follow the instructions. For iPhone, iPad go to settings tap on general scroll down and tap on transfer or reset iphone tap on reset then select reset network settings it will ask for your iphone's passcode enter it after you enter your passcode a prompt will appear on your screen asking for your confirmation. Tap on Reset Network Settings to confirm and your phone will restart. Method 4. Reset All Settings. To do this on Android device, go to Settings. 
Scroll down then tap on General Management. Tap on Reset. Tap on Reset All Settings. Tap on Reset Settings. It will ask for your phone's passcode. Enter it and follow the instructions. For iPhone, iPad, go to Settings. Tap on General. Scroll down and tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Tap on Reset, then select Reset All Settings. It will ask for your iPhone's passcode. Enter it. After you enter your passcode, a prompt will appear on your screen asking for your confirmation. Tap on Reset All Settings to confirm and your phone will restart. On PS4, PS5, go to Settings. Scroll down then select Initialization. Select Restore Default Settings. It will ask for your system restriction passcode. Enter it. Select Restore. Method 5. Try Enable UPnP or Open Port Forwarding. If your router supports UPnP, enable it on the router. To do this, launch a browser on your computer or mobile. Type in your IP address in the address bar which in most cases is 192.168.1.1. This is the IP address which is associated with your router. You can also check the backside of the router to get the IP address. Press Enter to navigate to the ISP's login page. Enter the username and the password for your router. Now, you just need to find it in your settings for your router and enable it. If your router does not support UPnP, adjust the router's port forwarding setting to allow communication to your PlayStation 4 console from the Internet. The port numbers that are used by Remote Play are 9295, for TCP, and 9296 and 9297, for UDP. If these ports are unavailable, it might be possible to use ports 9295 through 9304, for TCP and UDP. For information about these settings, please refer to the instructions supplied with your router. If your PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 5 console is connected to the Internet via two or more routers, communication may not work correctly. That's it guys, hope this is useful. If you have any further questions, please feel free to get in touch or leave a comment. Thanks.